Prepare to read. Dear Dragon, Notice and Note. Aha Moment. Genre Study. Fantasies are imaginative stories with characters and events that could not be real. Letters are written messages from one person to another. Poetry uses the sounds and rhythms of words to show images and express feelings. Fantasies often include events that do not follow the laws of nature and time. Letters begin with a greeting and end with a closing. Poems use descriptive language and often rhyme. Set a purpose. Dear Dragon Written by Josh Funk Illustrated by Rodolfo Montalvo Hello, students. Our poetry and pen pal projects this year are combined. Upon your desks, you'll see the pen pals that you've been assigned. Projects. Projects are tasks that take time and effort to complete. Assigned. If someone assigned a task to you, he or she gave you some work to do. Please make sure the letters that you write are all in rhyme. Now open up your envelopes because it's pen pal time. September 12th. Dear Blaze Dragomir, We haven't met each other, and I don't know what to say. I really don't like writing, but I'll do it anyway. Yesterday, my dad and I designed a giant fort. I like playing catch and soccer. What's your favorite sport? Sincerely, George Slayer. October 1st. Dear George Slayer, I also don't like writing, but I'll try it, I suppose. A fort is like a castle, right? I love attacking those. My favorite sport is skydiving. I jump near Falcor Peak. Tomorrow is my birthday, but my party is next week. Sincerely, Blaze Dragomir. October 31st. Dear Blaze Dragomir, You know how to skydive? That's as awesome as it gets. My dog destroyed my fort last night. Do you have any pets? Happy birthday, by the way. I don't have mine till June. I'm trick-or-treating as a knight. We're heading out real soon. George Slayer November 14th Dear George Slayer, Nights are super scary. I don't like to trick-or-treat. Brushing teeth is such a pain. I rarely eat a sweet. My pet's a Bengal kitten, and tonight she needs a bath. What's your favorite class in school? I'm really into math. Blaze Dragomir December 16th Dear Blaze D, My favorite class is art. I made a mold of my left hand. Next, we'll craft mosaics using pebbles, stones, and sand. Yesterday, I won a prize in this year's science fair. My towering volcano blasted lava everywhere. George S. Mosaics Mosaics are pictures or patterns made from smaller pieces of glass, stone, or other materials. January 18th Dear George S., My father's won our local fire-breathing contest twice. He still retains the record, melting 50 cubes of ice. Do you have any hobbies? I enjoy collecting rocks. I keep them in a secret place inside a precious box. Blaze D. Retains. If someone retains something, he or she has something and keeps it. Precious. If something is precious to you, it is important or valuable to you. February 22nd. Blaze. Fire breathing? What's your father's job? My folks are teachers. I collect exotic monsters, animals, and creatures. Oh, guess what? I heard the news this morning from Miss Sweet. A pen pal picnic's planned for June. At last we'll get to meet. George. March 15th. George. 
Dad's in demolition. He works hard throughout the day. But every night we read a book or pick a game to play. Soon he's going to take me flying, once it's really spring. It's such a rush to ride the air that flows from wing to wing. Blaze. Demolition. If you work in demolition, your job is to tear down or destroy buildings. April 11th. Hi, Blaze. Skydiving and flying lessons? Wow, your parents rock. I'm lucky if my father lets me bike around the block. Once the school year's over and this project is complete, should we continue writing? Because it could be kind of neat. Your friend, George, May 12th. Hey, George. I'm psyched about the picnic and I can't wait to attend. Who'd have thought this pen pal thing would make me a new friend? Writing more sounds awesome. I was going to ask you, too. I've never liked to write as much as when I write to you. Your friend, Blaze. Blaze? George? My pen pal is a dragon? My pen pal is a human? Collaborative discussion. Respond to the text. Look back at what you wrote on the Prepare to Read page. Work with a group to discuss the questions below. Refer to details and examples from Dear Dragon to support your answers. Take notes for your responses. Follow the rules for polite discussion by being a good listener and by taking turns speaking.